to this team? What does this team look like with a full offseason, a full training camp, a full preseason, and then a full season? I think that this team could really make some noise and, and cause some damage, right? Yeah. Um, but we need LeBron, right? And, and that's the whole thing. So hopefully the rehab kind of picks up, puts him in a good position. He's able. There's no setbacks or anything like that. He is a guy that spends, you know, a million, two million dollars on his body every year. So he takes care of himself. He's that guy that if anyone can come back uh, in a reasonable time, it's him. I don't have doubts about that. Um, but, I mean, this is an injury that has been bothering him all season. And best case scenario is we were able to weather the storm. We're able to ride it out. We are in a playoff or play-in position. And LeBron comes back, and he's healthy and ready to go, right? Yeah. I mean, him getting three, four weeks, uh, yes, he's going to be rehabbing a foot injury, but the rest of his body. You know, his back, his his legs, his knees, his his other foot, everything is getting rest right now. And everything is just is allowing him to kind of get healthy. I think that that is very valuable in itself. But what do you think? Uh, what do you think about the whole LeBron situation? Uh, what is your hopes in that scenario? Uh, hopefully he comes back, obviously, like as soon as possible. But um, definitely like. You know, if we get into the playoffs, we're definitely going to need him back. My thing is, I, I don't know. I don't know. I just have this strange feeling that, like, if they're not careful with this, it could, yeah, it could end up being, like, you know, like a really, really bad injury. You know, like like the Achilles, like Kobe's Achilles or something like that. Like, something crazy. Yes, where you just, you. Well, you know what I mean? Like, like, really, like, it's something that you don't really come back from you know what i mean um that you or at least that you can't come back fully and then you're just not the same player you know then it forces him into like an early retirement you know so because as it is right now he maybe has three to five more years in the league and i'm not trying to put like a limit on him but let's face it that's facts are facts i think you know that the reality of the situation is we got lebron in the nba for maybe three to five more years so worst case scenario this goes bad he sits out for a year maybe year and a half comes back but it's not the same lebron but then best case scenario he comes back and he's fine <laughs> you know what i mean but like i just i don't know um i think that yeah that that, that that's rough because it's like you said you don't want to rush it but at the same time we need him we really yeah. do like i just mm, it, it's gonna be a tough 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 get into the playoffs without him do i think we yeah. can do it yeah but do i think we will do it that's a different question i'm not gonna say no to that because i it's 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 a coin toss right now, you know what I mean? It just depends Realistic. on depends on Delo, really. It depends on Delo. Yeah. It depends on yeah, because he's such a big factor of this whole equation. So, yeah, I, I think I think realistically, I think with LeBron's injury, I think the six seed. Not that we can't get it, we can. I mean, we're only like two games, two and a half games, something like that, out of the six seed. But it's just it's just gonna be really hard without LeBron. I think if we had LeBron this whole time, one, I don't I don't know I don't know if we would have lost a game yet outside of that Portland game. We might not, because yeah. I think we beat Memphis with LeBron. I think we would have beat Minnesota with LeBron. I think we beat both of those guys with just D-Lo back. Imagine if we yeah. had LeBron. Um, so, but I think going forward, we definitely would win enough games, I think, to get into that 6 seed, especially with some of the these other teams that are ahead of us. They just have really tough schedules. Um, but in general, um, I think that uh, – we we can I think without LeBron we can still get that seventh to eighth seed, um, which I'm okay with. Now obviously I don't want to be in the play in that sucks, but if we're in the seventh to eighth seed, you only got to win one game. You have two chances to win one game, and then you're in. Um, I think we can easily win one of those games. I don't yeah. think we lose two straight, especially with this roster, especially with a healthy LeBron, especially with AD playing the way he's playing. Uh, so I think that would be huge. I think we get the win and we get into the playoffs. Problem is, is if we end up in like that, that nine to ten spot, yeah, that's when things get really tough. Because not that we can't win two straight games, it's just it's so hard, you know, because you don't have to be the best team. You only have to be the best team that one game. Yeah. You know, so say we play the Pelicans, right? And you know, the Pelican or the Pelicans, um, let's say they just shoot the lights out like Portland did. Yeah. Nothing you can do about it. Now, in a seven-game series, you could brush that off and, you know, okay, it was just a bad game. They shot the lights out. They're not going to do that again the rest of the series. And you can go win the rest of the matchup. But yeah. problem is, is that one game, you only have to be the best team one game. So that becomes 
that's where things become very challenging, very difficult. Now, um, also, if we did win, like let's say we do, let's say we are the ninth seed, we say we finish, we end up making the playoffs. You just played two grueling games, very likely, and now you have to go with like no rest <laughs> at all. You got like a day, I think, in between. With no rest, you immediately got to go play a seven-game series against Denver. Now, I do think we could beat Denver in a seven-game series. I do like our matchup against Denver in a seven-game series. But after playing two extra games that are just grueling, tough, and exhausting, to go play Denver, who is fresh, rested, and ready. And it depends on who we play in those two games, too. Because, like, you know, like, whoever – honestly, either way you chop it up, whoever it lands on, it's like – Well, I mean, look at it right now. Right now, we would probably – most likely, we would play – like the Pelicans, that's what I'm which saying. I think we could beat yeah. the Pelicans, and then after that, we play either the Clippers or the Mavericks. Like, well, that's what I'm, that, well, that's what I'm saying. And either we way, the, we haven't beaten the Clippers in three years. Well, that's what I'm <laughs> saying. Either way, one of the games are going to be tough. Like there's, like you know what no, I mean. I, like we're not going to get into like those a, games are probably going to be tough. Yeah, Pelicans. Yeah, I I do agree. It's a tough game, but it's more so a tough game without LeBron. Without with LeBron, I think we'll be okay. Yeah. Um, and honestly, I just. Since one of those matches are going to be tough either way, yeah. When you when you put those two like in combination, like when you get to the first round, like that would suck to have to play Denver. Yeah, yeah. Like and Look, and and potentially go a seven game series in the first round if you're facing a Denver because I feel like the, those two teams are equally matched. I feel like we could go seven game series on that one. I don't know if we're going to, but I feel like it, that is more than likely a seven game series. I think if we play Denver, and then you're and tired going series. into the second round. It sucks. Yeah. Well, yeah, absolutely. But I think I think if we play Denver in any series but the first seed, I think we could I think we could really I think we could beat Denver. First round makes it tough because not saying that we can't, but yeah. you're going to have you're gonna have a lot of factors. You have one, you're gonna have the inexperienced guys, you're gonna have the jitters and the nerves and all that stuff. Um, and then you're just gonna have the the working out, the grind, right? Because this is yeah. a new team that just got put together. It's just really tough. Where if like if like if we played the Grizzlies or we played like the Kings in the first round, I think we could beat them because I just think LeBron James and Anthony Davis alone are enough. You know, assuming other guys just step up. Well, yeah, they have the experience. They're the veterans. They can exactly. kind of carry the team. Um, right now, we don't have a huge amount of playoff experience on our team right now. Like we have, yeah. we have some guys, but we don't have. You know, like it's not like you know Golden State where like the overall majority is just like we got championship DNA. You know what I mean? It's just not. Yeah. You know, it's not like that. So Absolutely. I would love to see a Grizzlies in the first round. I would love to see that. I, I Absolutely. Would I, I, I Honestly, like, if we're healthy, like, in a perfect world, I would love to – because I do think we can beat anybody. I would love, like, a – I don't know. I would love, like, a, let's assume we get into the playoffs, right? <laughs>